uh, hey guys um, you might have the read the title so let's get on today we'll be drawing uh, mowgli and balu from the movie uh, mowgli or no 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 jungle book uh, first we'll be drawing this um uh then is balu's hair uh like striky hair so this photo will be uh this photo will be the like the photo of where the B- balu and mogli are playing in the water i think and where the song the bear necessities come is that that song or okay i still stand in yeah yeah okay why am i singing the song okay i'm so bored next balu's neck so first we'll be drawing balu then we'll be going to mogli uh then mogli's body then his hair outline is outline of the uh, hair both are same i guess i know then his hair stripes i mean wrinkles uh then his hair which is falling out of his face i mean out of his face no out of his head and then his face then his eyes then his mouth then his knee which is coming out of balu's other side and then his shorts i think then his leg half leg is going inside the water so you can't see the foot then it's joining back into his his uh, shorts shorts then the water they look they look like uh, oval to me or a circle okay i don't mind and then the wrinkles in the water where balu is standing i mean swimming then we need blue black brown orange and dark blue first 
color in his hair with black uh, like solid black then i sharpened the pencil because it was so blunt that the color was not coming right so i did sharp it then the hair part where it comes off behind that fuzz face i mean face then take the black and give a light shading in balu's fur because i didn't have gray at that moment so i used light black so light black so which is technically gray so i did darken up that part there is head because it was too light then i added some shadings because uh, mowgli's hands uh, shadow needs to fall so i did shading then it's done so then i'm taking a pencil then for the lighter parts of then for the lighter parts of uh, balu i am i'm using a pencil and shading it light because it needs to be light then i realized that the both the colors were same so i smudge i try to smudge it out but it still was the same
so i did darken up the fur a little bit i didn't show that on camera so then i'm giving the same light shading to balu's mouth his upper jaw and lower jaw and smudging it out so it will not be like lines it will be like a smooth surface then i'm taking a pink sketch and coloring uh, balu's tongue tang with it then so that's done then i'm taking red sketch and coloring mowgli stung then i'm taking a black pencil again and coloring in that black left over space from that tongue in mowgli's mouth then i'm taking orange this is a fact that i didn't have peach at that time so if you use orange lighter the peach you'll be ended up with a peach color so i did that because i didn't have peach at that moment then for his body then to his face after that giving a darker coat to his body and then the legs well that's done then i realized the peach was so light so i shaded it with the brown to make the shadows i'm really happy that i give give gave the shadows to the moglis thing that's balu shadow in his knee and this is hair shadow in his face so that's that then i'm adding the shots like shadow then his arms shadow then i'm ha- adding the shadow from the ankle then i'm taking orange and giving orange to mowgli's pants then i'm taking brown again and giving a little shading to his pants or shorts whatever
then I'm taking blue for the pond pond or lake whatever you want to call it then Balu's nose I darkened it up I darkened it up with some black because I didn't have dark brown so then it's done then I cut it out then that's it hope you like this video if you did